Hey guys, so I just wanted to, I, I think I'm going to put this as my starting, like my little intro for my next vlog, because I'm not recording one tonight, which is the, hold on, is the, is Labor Day, so it's the, the 3rd, so September 3rd, um, but I just wanted to show you guys my awesome new setup that I just created, which I'm really freaking proud of, as you can see, it's 11.55 now, so um, I'm pretty tired, which is why I'm not going to record a whole vlog today about the weekend, but I'll do it tomorrow since there'll be more to talk about, and I'll have more content that way. But I'm really proud of this setup. Um, you know, I used to just have the the keep the charger set up over there, but now I have this awesome computer setup, which allows me to dual screen my computer onto the television. And I just actually finished my homework to program an equation calculator. As you can see, there's it all right there. Um, and I'm about to show you what that does because I, I realize I haven't shown you guys at all what I do. So as you can see, this is the assignment. Um, let me just bring my mouse over here. Uh, there's all the instructions, follow all that. And then this is like kind of a guideline of what you're supposed to do. These, these are the um, inputs you're supposed to put in, and I can talk about that in, here in a second, and then I'm about to turn it in. But, in theory, what this is, is it's a calculator to, let me move my mouse back over to the television. Oh, well, I also have to, hold on, I actually am missing one little thing. I need to close the key. key board uh, I think that does it I think if I remember correctly I'm trying to show you guys a little bit of what I do or keyboard dot close I did it wrong so let me just enter that real quick keyboard dot co don't want to drop you guys dot close parentheses, semicolon. All right, so as you can see right there, that's all of my all of my programming, and I will run it for you guys. Um, and then down here, as you can see, it'll ask for the alpha acids. Let me get a little bit closer so you guys can see that. So it's asking for alpha acids, and I need to put in point, or 5.0. There we go. For this, I need to put in, for ounces, it's 2 ounces, and the HB is come out as 10.00. And the weight, if I remember correctly, is 1. The lava bond is 80, and the volume is 5. And it inputs uh, 9.5000. Now, why it does that is, for the first one at least, it's this equation right here. Or no, wait, where is it? Where's my HBU's equation? There it is, it's alpha acid times ounces. And then it displays two uh, decimals. And I know this can be a little boring, but I just wanted to kind of give you guys a little taste of what I do. I'm gonna try and hold this steadier. All right, and then the second equation to get the SRM is 0.3 times weight times lava bond divided by volume plus 4.7. And that comes out to 9.5 plus four decimal points, which is what that does. So yeah, that's kind of a little bit of what I do um, for my major. I do this kind of thing, um, programming calculators, stuff like that. So if you ever wanted to know, yeah, this is the kind of stuff I do. This is probably the most complicated one I've done so far. It has almost 50 lines of code. Um, well, almost, considering I put spaces in between them, so maybe about 30 or so. But yeah, I'm actually really proud of this, which is why I'm recording this for you guys to kind of show you what I'm going to do. And I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow for the vlog. And so this is kind of like a little taste of yesterday. And actually, if you look over there, it's about to hit midnight. I guess we can watch this hit midnight. And then I guess I will see you guys in a couple hours. So we're just going to sit here and wait it out. And I'm just going to talk to you guys until it changes. And then I'm going to cut the video. I'm waiting. And we're waiting, and we're waiting, and we're waiting, and waiting, and waiting, 
and waiting and waiting. This is getting boring. I'm sorry. I'm an idiot for trying to do this. Oh my god. What am I doing with my life? I need to clean my room. I need to sort my clothes. I need to get my backpack ready for tomorrow. Please, for the love of God, change. I feel like an idiot right now. Please, please. I'm just gonna... There we go. All right. I guess I will see you guys in a couple of hours. Uh, bye, bye, bye. Hello, everybody. It is tomorrow, and boy, do I have a lot to talk about. I'm going to do a... Uh, today is day... Let's see. Um, I can't count anymore because my August is gone. It is day 20... Four, if I've calculated correctly. And today's vlog is brought to you by the symbol slash N. That will be explained later. Also, you can see the reflection of, of you guys in the in the freaking thing. That's awesome. Anyway, I'll explain that later. But first of all, let me just do a quick clip notes of what happened over the weekend, because there wasn't really that much that happened event-wise. I mean there was, but it's just kind of easily explained. Um Saturday, came back home. That was real nice. Went to um, went to the state fair with my family and my girlfriend, uh, and we went to the demolition derby, which was awesome. The ending was lackluster because they did a round that didn't even matter, uh, and they that's what they ended with. Uh, and the round before that was like the big finale round, and uh, it was just kind of dumb. But anyway, um, then on Sunday I went on a date with my girlfriend, and we went out and we saw Alpha, uh, the new movie. That movie's great. I 100% recommend that movie. It is amazing. Um, and then we went to the Balloon Glow. And if you don't know what that is, on Labor Day, which was yesterday, they do this whole uh, balloon liftoff. But the night before that, they just set all the balloons out in a field. And they do at night, they do this whole like balloon glow. So they light the fires and do like this little light show with the balloons. It's really awesome. And it looks amazing. It's really nice. So that was really nice to do. Um, then on Monday, my family and I, we got to beta test a new escape room. There's, I can't really talk about it much because then that would kind of ruin the escape room for whoever watches this. Uh, all I can say is that it's based on a, um, it's a, it's a rock star kind of escape room, which is totally different from, them, from what I've ever seen. We unfortunately didn't beat the escape room because it was really hard. Um, so that was, that was sad. Uh, we almost did it, but we, uh, we couldn't get the last couple of steps. So we were almost there. Um, let's see what else. Uh, and then that was kind of it. Then I came back home, uh, and then I just kind of sat around and did some homework. Uh, and I had this new setup, which is what you saw earlier in the vlog. Uh, and so yeah, now today, uh, woke up, went to lit class. We worked on <coughs> peer reviewing each other's, uh, summaries. I gotta work on those later because they're due this Sunday. So got those to do. Um, then I took a little break, went to the math center to get my questions for my math homework that I did right as I came back home. And I tried to complete my, uh, homework because I was missing a period in some of the, in some of the code lines and I couldn't figure that out. So I was getting, I wasn't getting, um, full credit for the entire assignment. So I was going to go to the, to the computer science, science, uh, building to go figure that out because I had a lab there anyway. I went there. I uh, didn't have enough time to ask them, and we took a quiz. And this is where, this is where this comes in. So, the, if you don't know, computer science-wise, this on a printf format. I know this is going to sound like gibberish to you guys, but this means end of line, start new line. So that means that it cuts off whatever is happening before it, and then starts a new line. And anything that comes after that point is started on a new line. So, my problem. I had this problem twice now. Uh, so on the regular assignment that I showed you guys earlier, I was trying to print out um, the blah, 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 blah is this much, period. But what was happening was that the period was going to the next line because I put the period after the N, which put it on the next line. So I go to take the quiz today, which was effectively the same thing, make an, make an algorithm that calculates itself where you enter the numbers and then it calculates it all out. And then it, I entered it in to get graded and it said my, the, the one last one that said the average assignment is um, blah, 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 blah. And it said that it was missing, it had this 
backslash symbol next to the master to the master thing that says if it's right or wrong and it said it was right but it's missing some some white space or some white space is wrong white space tab or end of line so you can imagine my frustration to when I was trying to enter everything doing different spaces doing different uh, tabs doing different everything that I was missing this at the end of the of the line of, t of code so I did that twice I placed the period in the wrong place for my regular assignment and didn't include this on my quiz. Luckily, I figured it out and got 100% on my quiz. So then after that, came here, hung out a little bit, um, just kind of sat around, did some more of my math homework, just finished off like the last couple of questions. Then went to my calc lab, or calc, yeah, calc lab, and we did that. Uh, we worked on some new stuff, uh, continuity stuff. Uh, and that was kind of it. Came back here, hung out a little bit more. I've got a little homework to do. Uh, it's not that important because it's like none of it's really due yet. I just want to get kind of like a head start on it. So, um, yeah, that's that. And uh, trying to think if there's anything else interesting. Uh, I went out to dinner with some friends where it is Sushi Tuesday at Brayden. So I got some sushi. That was good. Uh, I got some crab, cucumber, and avocado in it. So that was, that was pretty good. Um, what else? Um, then I came back here and I've just been watching videos. So, uh, yeah. So that was kind of uh, my my weekend in a Cliff Notes kind of version. So that's why this is a shorter video. Uh, I mean, it's not going to be as short with this with that previous segment showing you my whole setup with like the TV and the computer and all that kind of stuff, uh, showing you all that and showing you the coding that I did so I can like show you guys kind of what I do to kind of explain what I do for a major anyway. But I guess I will see you guys tomorrow, which will be Wednesday, the fifth. See you guys then.